Confusion in Oweri as man is shot dead by police officers on stop and search duty. A man identified as Oguzi Manzi has been shot dead by police officers on stop and search duty in Oweri on Saturday afternoon. Politics Nigeria gathered that the incident occurred along Umwaka Orodo Road, Olo. The deceased, a native of Amucha, Njaba, local government area of the state, was on his way to wedding ceremony when he was stopped by the trigger happy officer and shot the policeman quickly fled the scene in a hillock's vehicle. It was gathered that the late Mercy, who was popularly called Barrister, was rushed to the Federal Medical Center in Oweri for treatment, but unfortunately gave up the ghost. Eyewitness reports indicate that the deceased was thought to be a lawyer because of a sticker of the Nigerian Bar Association, NBA, that was seen on his vehicle with red number. But this was quickly debunked by the Oweri branch of the organization via a statement signed by its secretary, Chinedu Ago. The disease, though, had NBA sticker in his car, a Toyota Camry with number, was not a lawyer, as the wife confirmed to me. He was merely friend of lawyers. In the words of his wife, Ago revealed, he called on the Human Rights Committee of the NBA to investigate and ensure that the culprits of these heinous acts are unedited and brought to book. Thank you for listening to this news. See, the crime, the crime and atrocity our, 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 our Nigerian police force are committing is is becoming enormous by the day. It's becoming enormous by the day. If we start counting the atrocity committed by our, our Nigerian police, my dear, you will marvel. You will marvel and you will shake your head and say they don't deserve existing in Nigeria. Our Nigerian police are nothing to write home about. They are nothing to write home about. They are complete disgrace to the masses. A complete one. See how they wasted the life of this of this young man. He, I don't know. I do I don't I don't just know. The orientation they get, why in the Nigerian police force to me, it's not enough. It's not enough because when it's when it's when it's time for interrogation, our Nigerian police force they they they, they are totally they they, they 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 get lost completely. They are totally out of it. Totally out of it. And it giving us a lot of concern. When you question a Niger when a Nigerian police officer interrogates you and asks you a question and you try to prove prove yourself and and uh, try to um, to to show that yes you have all that is asking for and giving him the right answer, this Nigerian police officer would still come up with something that. That, that will make you to feel feel uncomfortable. They will make you to feel uncomfortable. The period of COVID-19 is a testifier. You need to see the, the, the mirrors atrocity our Nigerian police force are saying committing. They committed all sorts, all sorts of unbelievable acts and atrocity. Atrocious acts, unbelievable ones. They arrest both the innocent and the uninnocent. 
The people they're not supposed to attack, they attack. Is that not what led to this um, dismissing of uh, of of of, of uh, SARS officials? Is that not? What we warrant them to end up shooting, shooting a man, shooting a man in a in just an ordinary search, search, uh, searching, searching, stop and search duty. My viewers, this is the re reason why this uh, uh, this restructuring really need to come to play. This is the reason why there is need for the existence and coming into play of this uh, 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 of, a of, of this restructuring. Because we, there is no way we can continue like this. There is no way we can continue like this. If nothing is done concerning this, I'm afraid. I'm afraid we we'll all just fall out. We we'll all fall out, and no one is praying for that. Enough is enough for a young police force. Enough is enough for them. They have overdone and that they are overchewed. We must not give in to their to their to their to their, to their deceits. We must not. They can't just be killing people and be going scot free like that. Are they the only force we have in Nigeria? After committing this atrocity, they they all go um, they will just they will all disappear and 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 and, um, and remain scarce. Why is it like that? Why is it like that? And for what reason? For what reason? Huh? My viewers, it's our time President Mobari starts doing something concerning our Nigerian police force. It's our time it starts acting fast before um, the, the what before what is more than the NSAS protest comes up. Because if what is more than the NSAS protest comes up, I'm afraid this particular one will be will will, will, will lead to uh, to revolution as Aisha Yusuf has earlier stated. You understand? So please and please my viewers um, with all that I've just been said I want to believe that you have your own um, comments to leave behind. Deem it free to leave them below the comment box. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.